as a result of what they understand is always going to be external and superficial. And inward kulli shay, inward encompasses all power, all realities, external encompasses only of the material world. So that's limited. So what Allah describes of the material world is that uh, it's perishing and it's not even comparable to the truth because when the truth comes to that which is perishable which is the material world, everything in the material world is perishing, is dying, is falling apart, it never… it doesn't stand with eternity to be eternally there. Every tree perishes, every cell, every organism, every creation on this abode is perishing. And Allah is describing for us, قُلْ جَاءَ الْحَقْ that tell them that when the truth comes the falsehood perishes and that falsehood by its nature zahukan crumbles. So the whole of material world is false. So that which people only look to the outside and they, they consider their religion and their path only the external world, Allah is giving for us zahukan, it's crumbling. Means your understanding of your religion, your faith, your practice, whatever it is, is crumbling. Because it's all based on the form and the external world which by its nature disappears. That's why everything dies, everything tastes of death. But the one who moves towards the truth and to the light and marifa and realities, then they're moving to that which is eternal. So the light is eternal, the, ter the light has by its science no time. So it's not bound by time 